This was tested in 2002, paper one number 19, and we are told an unbiased coin uh, with two faces, head and tail, is tossed three times. Uh, lists all the possible outcomes, hence determine the probability of getting at least two heads on one tail. Part B of the question, during a, a certain motor rally, it is predicted that the weather will be either dry or wet. The probability that the weather will be dry is estimated to be 7 over 10. The probability for a driver to complete the rally during the dry weather is estimated to be 5 over 6. The probability of a driver to complete the rally during the wet weather is estimated to be 1 over 10. Uh, complete the probability 3 diagram given below to max. What is the probability that uh, the driver completes the rally? Uh, Roman number 2. The weather was wet and the driver did not complete the rally. Uh, although this was tested as a single question, we are going to separate it uh, uh, because uh, uh, there are there are two different questions actually. The first one will need to draw its own uh, its own uh, three diagram involving the coin. And since we are told it is an biased coin, then what it means is that the probability of getting a head or a tail is actually a half. That is what that implies. So you extend your tree diagram to three branches. Uh, the other one is uh, we are it, we are told uh, about the uh, uh, motorari. Uh, the probability that, that we are given the tree diagram here. So if the pro if the probability that the weather is dry is estimated to be seven over ten, the dry the probability of the driver completing the rally, it means that uh, if it is seven over ten, dry, uh, the probability is dry, it is actually three over ten that the weather is wet. Uh, then uh, we complete uh, the the other branch, the probability of a rally of a driver to complete the rally during the wet weather is uh, estimated to be one over ten. So not to complete is actually 9 over 10. Uh, this one during the dry uh, weather, the probability is estimated to be uh, to be 5 over 6 to complete the rally. So the probability of not completing is actually 1 over 6. So we are going to divide this into two parts, uh, then we solve them differently. Uh, but finally, you should be able to get yourself eight marks. So the first part of the, the question of the coin, we are told it is two three uh, times. Uh, so we have the first toes. We can get a head or a tail. If you get a head, the second toes, you can get a head or a tail. If you get a tail the first time, you can get a head or a tail the second time. Then the third time, if you get a head, you can also get a head or a tail. Uh, here you can get a head or a tail. Uh, then here we can get a head or a tail. And finally, we have a branch, a head or a tail. Uh, so since it is an unbiased coin, then we, the probabilities are equal, so one one out of two options, so the, it's a half, uh, all of them. Uh, so here we feel is a half, uh, it's a half, uh, it's a half, a half, a half, a half, a half, a half, a half. Uh, we have a half, and finally a half here. So those are the probabilities. Uh, so we can check the outcomes here and say uh, here we can get a head, a head and a head. So we have a head, a head and a head. Then we have a head, a head and a tail. This will simplify uh, for us getting the probability. So this is a head, a tail and a head, a head, a tail and a head, a head, uh, a tail and a tail. Then we have a tail, a head, and a head. Then we have a tail, 
a head and a tail uh, then we have a tail we have a head and uh, not a head but uh, we have a tail we have a tail and a head and finally we have a tail a tail and a tail so paloma number one for at least two heads uh, so we can say probability that uh, we get at least two heads uh, so we can come and say here we have uh, uh, here we have well, uh, two, three heads so one here we have two uh, here we have two so we have on four uh, is equals to four out of one two three four five six seven eight four out of eight so this implies that the probability of getting at least two heads is a half uh, from there part two of the question we are told only one tail uh, so this is a probability of getting only one tail on one tail uh, tail so this is equals to uh, and this is uh, one area we have on a one tail here we have one tail and uh, one and here we have one tail so it is three out of eight and that is how you work out that so let's go to part section uh, b of the question so in the second uh, part of the question uh, we are told that uh, uh, the, the probability that the weather will be dry is estimated to be 7 over 10 which we are already given here so the probability that the, the weather will be wet is 3 out of uh, 3 out of 10 uh, so that when you add 3 over 10 plus 7 over 10 you get 1 then we are told the probability that the driver will complete the the, the rally during the dry weather is 5 over 6 so complete here is 5 over 6 so not complete is 1 over 6 so that when you add you get 1 the probability of com completing when it is wet is 1 over 10 so the probability of not completing when it is wet is actually 9 over 10 so with this probability we can be able to work out this the driver completes the rally probability that the driver completes the rally uh, so this means that uh, this is a probability that uh, uh, probability that it is dry and uh, the driver completes the rally or it is a uh, or probability that uh, the weather is wet and the driver completes the rally which is equals to uh, this will be 7 over 10 uh, you multiply by 5 over 6 uh, plus uh, f uh, 3 over 10 uh, multiply not uh, multiply by complete the rally is 1 over 10 so when you multiply this uh, you can simplify here and say this is uh, by 5 1 by 5 is 2 uh, so this is uh, uh, this is equals to uh, 7 over 12 12 and then we have a uh, plus uh, pl uh, plus uh, 3 over 100 uh, so this uh, this is equals to uh, this is going to give you uh, 350 uh, plus 18 that is when you get the LCM is 600 and this is equals to uh, uh, that is uh, 368 divided by 600 uh, you, mu you simplify this you should be able to get uh, 46 out of uh, 75 uh, the second part of the question uh, we say the probability that the weather is wet was wet and the driver did not complete the rally so this is a probability the weather was wet and the driver did not complete the rally is equals to the weather was wet is 3 over 10 uh, multiplied by did not complete the rally is 9 over 10 uh, so this is equals to when you multiply there is nothing we can uh, simplify here so it is 27 out of 
uh, 100. So that is a uh, way you work out uh, that part. Uh, so in total, you have and uh, you'd have and uh, eight marks. This teacher creations. You can get me through the number showing on the screen, or you can get me through WhatsApp with the same number, or you can get me in Facebook teacher Mta. Uh, if you have any question, any inquiries, uh, you are all welcome.